So I am here visiting my grandson and he is out here doing some rooting and I wanted him to show you how we root our cuttings. So what you got going on? All right, so the first thing I do is this is a um, Tice cutting we got about, I think we got them yesterday. And um, so the first thing you wanna do is you want to take a, take a sharp knife and just gonna scrape the bark off. Okay, you just wanna scrape it down to the green where you see the green, you don't want yeah. Okay. Don't want to get it too deep. Just it helps it out when you do it this way. All right. Right there you go. Right. Once you get it about about there, you can do it all the way around if you want to, but you don't have to. Okay. I, just, I like to do it in one spot. Then you're gonna take rooting hormone. Just put some on it. This just makes it increases success on the cutting. Okay. And then I'm gonna take um, a pot. Okay. I I'm gonna fill it with um, dirt that I just got straight from wood chips broken down wood chips, but you can use um, peat moss. Most of the time I mix it with peat moss, but I'm out right now, so. All right, so once I get that, just stick it in there. Okay. All right, pack it down. Make sure it's, make sure it's good. It's not gonna wobble and fall out while it's grow, trying to grow some roots. All right, and there you go. Awesome. And so I wrap the top of my cuttings with buddy tape. It's about 95 degrees here. But Logan does not wrap his cuttings, and he has great success. So, either or. What you got going on out here? Okay, Your projects. So right back here, I have loquats, Japanese plums. I believe that's what they're called. Uh -huh. I'm grafting onto some of them. Got some successful grafts right here. Great. Those right what did around. you graft onto your seedlings? Um, seedlings, and then they grafted onto Christmas. Christmas, nice. Then over here I got tice that I did this morning. Down here I have um, Scarlet Beauty Plums. Okay. And I did these ones about a week ago, did these about three days ago. All so right. A couple batches there. Then I have some orange trees here that I started from seeds. Once they get bigger and start looking better, I'm gonna graft onto them. And over here we have um, Pakistan mulberries that I did two days ago, yesterday, two days ago. Then up here, I got a few more orange trees. What's that big one? This right here is a Maui that I started for my cutting. Okay. Then down here in the front, I have more Pakistan that I've taken. These were I've done like months ago. Okay. And then I got two ties right there. Um, over here, I have these in these pots right here. I have in these pots down here, I have the Mauis. Nice. And um, they're looking pretty good. Mm -hmm. And over here I have passion fruit that I started from seed. You can see a couple of them starting to come up. Very good. There it is. And yep, that's about all. Excellent. All right. Have a great day. Plant lots of fruit trees. Central Florida's on 9B. And we get about 100 chill hours.